What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Veteran Bassin. I'm here with my boy, Weezy F. Baby, a.k.a. Brandon. You know what I'm saying? What's Leo. up? <laughs> <laughs> but we're going to get out here. We're, at the, uh, we're back at the pond that y'all know, but y'all didn't really see too much of it. There's a lot of grass out here. There's a lot of grass out here. So um, we're going to come out here. It's midday, you know, first good chance of fishing without any rain. So we're going to get out here, see what it do. Let's go. I did all that talking. Junior caught one and I wasn't even recording. We might have to adjust. I might have to adjust. But Junior, he's, he got the first one. And he got that on a Cinco with a chartreuse tail. So, I'm hoping I don't get bit by a snake. That would not be very becoming. Let me figure out my way around this thing. To... All right. We got some chop on the water. That's. I should be throwing a moving bait. There's too much chop on the water. And the wind has picked up. But, considering the fact that I'm already over here, and my rods are over there for my moving bait, might as well sit here and Finish my round. We select really might be at the wrong pond. All right, I'm gonna go get my moving bait and see what I can get with that. Let me adjust my fishing difficulties and I'll be right back with y'all. I'm fishing. It is? Hmm? Oh, you like the gloves? Yeah. yeah. Tighten tungsten. Get you a pair. I'm gonna go change our rides. Yeah, it's a good breezy day. Wind is about, I would say three to five miles per hour. I should be throwing a moving bait, but I don't, I'm going to try square bill even though it's grassy. I'm gonna try that first. Then, if I'm catching too much grass and things ain't really going swimmingly for me, <laughs> I'll go ahead and I go to the lipless where I can about control where it's going to be at in the water column. So, that was a look at the kids that came out with us. I'll tell you one thing though, fishing, it makes sure I get my steps in, you know, because for real, for real, I'm supposed to be walking. I'm really are, oh wow, I really are. I really am, I'm supposed to be walking, so. Fishing kind of helps that out. And let's go. Digging in to the grass right at the bank. So I pretty much know where it's gonna start digging into the grass. 10-4. 10-4. For a while. Catching the grass again.
Huh. Don't want to mess that up. I'm catching more grass than a little bit. I might have to switch over to a lipless. Only problem with the lipless is it don't have that wide wobble that is good for the summer months. But considering the fact that we are about to get ready to go into the fall transition. So could be about time to start using a lipless. Yep. Bunch of grass. And I mean a bunch of grass. Junior, so far is the only person that caught a fish. And I haven't even gotten a bump or strike or however you want to call it. Yep. Hook grass again. And the thing about it is this grass is so thick that you got to kind of set the hook a little bit to move it along to get it unstuck. That's some bad grass. That's some real bad grass. Might have to go to a, a lipless. Well, not really because it's only on the edge that I'm getting it. So, we're gonna try something new that uh, I haven't used before, but I heard it is the bomb. We're going to go with and use a chatterbait. I'm going to go with a chatterbait. And uh, not just any chatterbait, we're going with the jackhammer. And uh, those things sell like hotcakes. They sell just as fast as, you know, the Guggen, the Guggen baits do. And I mean, they sell. So I've only been able to get one or two colors. And well, actually, I'm say two colors. <laughs> Cause for real, for real, I wasn't able to get anything else. But I will be able to get a Kitek. I will be able to put a Kitek on um, on this one. Hopefully, it'll work fairly well. But we're gonna find out. So. Let me uh, get that put on and get back to fishing. But in all truthfulness, like I say, I really believe that we got out here too early. I believe we did. Also, again, you know, love you guys out there, especially, you know, the guys out there out there doing their thing fishing. Make sure you hydrate, make sure you have your water raring to go i'm gonna hydrate put this lure on and get back out there be back with you look my daddy did theirs <laughs> <I got> it. <laughs> your daddy did that to you yeah how you do it oh, i'm getting tangled up over here your eyes ain't they over there telling on him now <laughs> snitching <laughs> hey they snitching for real I'm talking about they, 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 they ain't even dry snitching that's the weirdest snitching I ever seen in my life <laughs> you want to you ain't never lie they ain't really they ain't really hitting him but again I, I believe we just really came out too early Brandon. Run. Brandon. Brandon. <laughs> I don't see him. 
A bull? Yeah, I don't play with no, I don't play with no bull. Where you? Oh, I see you. Yeah, I don't play with no bull. <laughs> oh no, that ain't no bull. That's a cow. That's a, that's a cow. Yeah. I'll be the same, bro. We this time for us to get some get somewhere. You ready to go to the other pond? I'm gonna ride on the back this time so I can mess with the cows. I'm gonna ride on the back. What you gonna walk through? Oh, well, I'm gonna put my rides in the buggy. Now this pond right here, later on in the evening, top water be busting. Yeah. Yeah, but you gotta you gotta do that in the evening. We will make her dry. I'm gonna mess with the cows. Halftime break. It is 6.03. We got out here like four o'clock. And uh yeah, it's been a struggle. It's been a real struggle. So we we're gonna move to another pond and I don't know if we're gonna finish it out there or not, but we, we're gonna move to another pond and and give and give it a whirl. So, uh, thing I'm not liking about this is cows. Um, I'm not a country person by no means, and I don't deal with cows. But we're gonna see what happens. All right, let's get it going. Now they running cows. <laughs> you see this? This is not the kind of stuff that I like to deal with. That is a big boy right there. Oh, that is a bull. I thought bulls were supposed to have horns. Look at him. Look at how big that boy is. Oh, there's cows over there by that pond. <laughs> I am not liking this. a big boy I thought bulls really like I said I thought bulls supposed to have horns that kind of shocked me that they didn't and now they want to run the calf there's mama fighting back. So I caught a stick pounder. The conditions say, well, like somebody told me, you can't catch them all, but doggone it, I at least want one. And the wind is pushing into this bank. So, theoretically, the th good gracious. It's like I can't cast today. 
I think because the cows was over here also, I don't really believe you're gonna get, well, no, I don't really believe you're gonna get anything uh, on this side. Uh, what in the world is going on? So, this really hasn't been a good day. I threw off one fish. Not fish, I'm sorry. Threw off one crankbait. Been backlashing. Not really backlashing, but coming close. And then I got a bunch of cows looking at me real mad. <laughs> for being chased. I hope nobody messed with the brakes. Cause I'm not supposed to be like that. And they're over there doing a wheelbarrow race. <sighs> All right. Oh my goodness. Please don't tell me I blew it up. <sighs> Gosh dang. This has not been my day. Doggone it. Be back. On has. I'm waiting for this evening for the frog bite. See if that'll pick up, uh, pick things up. Knocking my glasses off my head. I can't believe it. I can't believe I did that. Wouldn't it be funny if the middle pond was the one that was catching? Well, those are the breaks. We came, you know, Junior caught one bass and one cat and they just wasn't hitting for me today you know that's just how it works that's how it works you know <laughs> it is what it is but hopefully you know I, I know it's finna rain again you can see the clouds kind of forming up um that could be the reason could the pressure could be you know a little bit greater than what it normally is. But in any case, <laughs> like and subscribe. You know, I feel I feel even bad asking you to like and subscribe after this one here. But like and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. And tune in if you continue want to see me fail at fishing. Alright, veteran bassin', we out.